Do you have anything on you that's gonna prick me, stab me, poke me, or cause me any harm today? With the loafers on though? Okay, I see you. Hey guys, what's up? I'm Diamond. If you're new to my channel, welcome. If you're not new, welcome back to another Grand Theft Auto LSPDFR episode. And today we have Officer Isla rocking a new hairstyle, a new hair color. You guys let me know if you're feeling it, okay? Like, I think she's looking great. So if we got any haters out there, um, too bad, because she's looking good, all right? And we also have a partner with us today. So shout outs to Macy, because anytime I have a partner, they always have my back. So hopefully she keeps that going, guys. But um, yeah, if you are not subscribed to this channel yet, make sure to go ahead and do so. Also, make sure to smash that like button and share this episode with your mama, your daddy, your cousin, your auntie, your uncle, your baby daddy, and your friends, okay? So um, yeah, I'm just out here at the golf club. We had a little, you know, situation going on on the, um, do they call it a field? But anyway, it was on the golf course. There we go. Um, so yeah, we just got it, you know, cleared up and stuff. They just wanted some police there. Somebody was drinking a little bit too much, you know, having a good time. So we got it all settled down and, um, yeah, we're going to go back on duty. So I hope that you guys are going to enjoy this episode, of course. And let's go ahead and, uh, let dispatch know that we are available for calls. Dispatch, show me available for calls. Acknowledged. One, queen, five. Proceed with patrol. All right, guys, let's roll out. So today we are going to be patrolling in the Morningwood slash uh, Vespucci Beach area. So I feel like we're not around here too much. It's crazy. Like, sometimes the map can seem so small until you actually ride out and you're like, bro, I haven't been over here in, like, forever. So I figured that you guys would kind of enjoy um, some new scenery and also bringing Officer Isla back for a little while. Um, so yeah, this is what we're gonna be doing today and let's just see what craziness we can get ourselves into. But also, if you guys can comment down below, like what is your favorite character for me to use? I have seven characters right now. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna make any more. And um, yeah, some of you guys have been asking like if I could leave a link to a mod babe i make these characters like these are these are mine so i don't know i might i might release one of them to you guys i don't know we'll see i'll probably do it for i don't i don't know i'm not gonna say too much i'll just just make sure that notification bell is turned on so that when i do anything y'all know but something is coming okay so um yeah definitely let me know if you guys like a certain character and yeah just let me know how you guys are feeling about it citizens report possible trespassing in morningwood response code two dispatch i'm responding roger response code two all right guys so we have a trespassing call i'm gonna go ahead and uh turn it around and see what we got going on so um it isn't too far away so what is going on with everybody running across the street all stupid crazy all right let's let's get out of here guys i don't know what is going on with these guys maybe they're racing each other who knows so it seems to be in this area over here so investigate the area for suspicious behavior all right dispatch show me on scene acknowledged one queen five proceed with caution all right guys i'm just gonna go ahead and take my flashlight see if i see anything out here i mean it's not that dark out here i'm just being extra so oh what the freak did you guys see anybody out there what the heck i didn't see anybody she saw them all right let's go so it seems why did i grab this why did i grab that okay dispatch show me in pursuit all right guys so I don't know if we're gonna need some help with him. Did she get him? All right, all right. Oh my gosh, she's gonna get him. Let me go ahead and get my stun gun. So I don't know what, let me hit that turbo right quick. All right, go ahead, Macy, go ahead, go ahead. All right, sir, get down on the ground or you're gonna get tased. Don't run into traffic, crazy head. Bruh. All right, guys, you're gonna get tased, man. Get down on the ground. Oh my gosh, she's in the way. 
All right, let's see. Yo, why am I always running all the way down the block? Like, this is crazy. Oh my gosh, sir, get down on the ground. Sir, get down on the freaking ground. All right, he's not listening, guys. There we go. Taser deployed. All right, get down, sir. All right, there we go. There we go. Get down. Get down. No sudden movements. No sudden movements, bro. Mind your business, sir. Like, we ran all the way back to the golf. <laughs> Basically, all the way back to where we started, guys. So, code four. Let's go ahead and take this guy back down to the scene of the crime. I'm going to go ahead and grab him. I don't even know how far we ran, guys. But we definitely need to see if he dropped anything um, back where we came from. Because that was kind of crazy. I thought that Macy was going to, like, jump on him or smack him or something. But I don't know. She definitely kept her eye on him. So I want to see what he was doing over there. So maybe he was just trespassing into the apartment. How far did we, did we go? All right, so I got to go down the street. All right, guys. So hopefully y'all enjoy this run back. I don't know if cops would usually do this. Or they would probably have like another cop come and put them in the car. So that they could probably run back and check everything out. But um, I don't got that right now, so yeah. But I want to see what he was doing over there, if there's anything that he dropped and such, because this dude skated off. I mean, I didn't even see him. Did you guys? So we'll we'll just see, you know. But am I going the right way, guys? Okay, great. Cause I'm just like, I feel like I'm going the wrong way right now. So he was around this apartment complex. I'm gonna go ahead and call some uh, backup over here to our our location. Let me go ahead and release him right here. What the freak? Did I put him in the back of my vehicle? Oh, okay. That's my bad, guys. So we'll see him in the back for now and uh, wait for another person to come, I guess. I'm gonna send him in the front seat. What the heck? Who was that? Guys, I'm tripping. <laughs> I am tripping. I GTA 5 glitch. That's all I can say. We're gonna release him. Um, I'm gonna get back in my vehicle, move out the way for this lady, and uh, call some backup to our location right over here. Dispatch requesting backup. Assistance required in uh, Pacific Bluff. Dispatch, show me on scene. All right, guys, so we got code three backup coming right now. I'm going to go ahead and just uh, take out my flashlight again and see if he dropped anything that I need to be worried or concerned about. But it looked like he was just trespassing. And man, if you don't. Yeah, I don't think he dropped anything. It looked like maybe he was just trespassing and some neighbors uh, were concerned and uh, just kind of called about him. It would be cool if this call out had like a... Uh, something where like they would drop something that'd be dope all right so sir do you have anything on you that's gonna prick me stab me poke me or cause me any harm today let's go ahead and check them i was hoping that they sent me uh some mails but y'all already know so yeah it might have been those neighbors up there calling about him all right so he has a pistol and a half gram baggie of brown powder Okay, dispatch, can I get a pet check on a Christian Jones? <laughs> okay, so driver's license valid, no active warrants. I'm gonna have my buddy do a drug swab on him, and um, yeah, hopefully, we can figure out like, was he under the influence or what? Um, I'm not too sure, but let's go ahead and figure it out, guys. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, check the weapon and check the baggie and all of that. Make sure you guys go ahead and like up this episode and also subscribe if you are not subscribed to the Diamond CKG squad already, okay? I just love when that pops out like that. I think that's so cool. Alright, so I'm guessing that this brown powder is like trees or something, but let's see for the most part. Alright, it's negative, so let's check if it's this right here. All right, okay, so it is positive for heroin, guys. Let's also check the um, weapon that he had on him, see if it's stolen or if it's even registered or anything like that, okay? 
All right, let's check it. Let's check it. Let me know. Do you guys think it's stolen? All right, so it's valid to a Christian Jones. Okay, that's pretty interesting. All right, let's go and uh, let's go ahead and Mirandize uh, this guy. All right, sir. So you have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in the court of law. You have the right to an attorney. If you can't afford one, one will be appointed to you. Having these rights in mind, do you wish to talk to me about anything? No. Okay. So let's see if we can ask him about um, the pistol. That's what I want to know uh, personally. So who does the weapon belong to? I'm invoking my rights. Okay. What about the narcotics? Where do they come from? I'm not saying anything. Okay. So he's really stone faced right now. So I'm going to go ahead and just write up uh, his charges right quick. And then we will have these two other officers take him in. So we do have him on trespassing. For the most part um so he does have a gun permit so i can't actually charge him for the weapon um you know and he had i mean possession of of heroin it was only like a half a gram so for the most part i don't know should we let him go with a citation on uh trespassing and running from law enforcement i don't know we could probably do they have that like running from law enforcement on citations who knows let's see but I think we can give him trespassing. And um, I, if they have running from law enforcement, we'll give him that. But I don't think I'm going to actually arrest this guy today. We might just let the officers, like, take him and, um, you know, let him ease out a little bit. But refusal to take, nah. I don't know. Let's see. Disturbing the peace. I don't know if they have trespassing. I'm, and that's also another thing, guys. I'm trying to um just like not arrest everybody i come into uh you know like contact with i'm trying to just give some citations and just give people a break for the most part so let's see yeah i'm not seeing running from law enforcement so if anything we might just let him go with that citations um one let's see warning yeah we might have let him go with just the uh, trespassing citation and like keep it moving let me know if you guys um agree with that or if you rather when i actually arrest people but i mean hey he didn't tell us that he had a gun on him but i mean it's all good he did have he does have a permit for it so i'm just gonna confiscate the um you know the illegal drugs from him and stuff like that and um then we'll just call it a day was he under the influence too guys I don't remember if he was. Did my buddy give him a drug swab? Let's see. I think she gave him a breathalyzer test. I don't remember doing a drug swab. Guys, I'd be forgetting. I'm not even going to lie to you. Okay, he was negative for everything. So we're going to go ahead and give him this right here. And um, he's going to be summoned in court. He didn't have a record, guys. So for the most part, I think that we could go ahead and, um, yeah, we could let him. we could let him go. Let me know if you guys agree with that or if you guys rather me throwing the book at him. But I'm trying to be more lenient. So let me guys, let me know Bullshit. what you guys think about that, okay? So he's going to have his ticket like so. And uh, we're going to be all good. Dispatch, show me code 4. I don't know why he ran like that, but hey. Attention all units. Code 4, no further units required. Um, since he didn't have a record, that's just what I decided to do. If he did have a record, we might have, you know, arrested him or whatnot. But, I mean, it's just my own discretion. But let me try to find my way up out of here, guys. This is a cool little little complex. I guess people around here don't like uh, people coming over here that don't live over here. I mean, who knows? But let's go ahead and get out of here and uh, call it a day. I don't know what is going on. Like my phone is just, every time I'm recording guys, every time, like what is going on? But, <laughs> oh my gosh, too funny. All right, let's see if we can find any crazy drivers around here in morning. What, what is this person doing? Okay, there's just, I thought something was going down right there. I'm not even gonna lie. But let's see, ooh, that's a nice vehicle. Oh, that's nice. That's nice right there. 
Okay, we're gonna continue to drive around. Definitely let me know if you guys enjoy these little, uh, just chill patrols, I guess you would call it. Dispatch, show me responding. All right, so civilian got shot in front of a store. All right, respond code three. So I said chill, this is nowhere near chill. We, we definitely, just ran like three blocks and then now we have a uh homicide what the freak move out the way no oh my gosh like they be going in the way on purpose bro like what's good with you all right excuse me move 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 get out the way move to the side get out the way i don't give a damn about this red light oh my gosh if y'all don't want to figure it out thank you oh my goodness all right, let's go ahead and find the um, the store that it's talking about. Who's this guy running? Is he a culprit? All right, let's show. Oh, another officer is already here. Yo, why is everybody running? Dispatch, show me on scene. All right, let's see what's going on, guys. So we gotta go ahead and investigate, and let's take a look around. They say. All right, so we see this woman right here. Oh my gosh. All right, so it says press Y to investigate the gun shells. Oh, that's right here. Okay, let's go ahead and press Y, guys. We're gonna search the body. Who's talking like that? Clue found, here's his driver's license. Okay. All right, let's go ahead and investigate the gun shells too. Which is right over there, if you guys see him. Five rounds, the suspect made sure he died. Okay. All right, is there anything else that we need to investigate or is it just two clues? Let me walk around. Ooh, yeah, that's what I'm talking about, inspect the bin. Okay. Oh, this is fire, this is fire. Okay, let's see what's going on. Um, a pistol, there could be, it could be a murder weapon. So I'm gonna inspect the weapon further. All right, there we go. Dispatch, I need the owner for a following gun serial number. Okay, so the gun belongs to Ace Cruz. All right, do we have anything? Sir, don't record this. Crazy. All right, is there any more clues that we uh, need? Yeah, that's, that's sad. Sorry to this lady. All right, let's speak to this guy right here. Sir, can you tell me uh, what you saw? Um, I was just standing around a corner. I heard shots. I ran and saw the poor guy on the ground. Okay, sir, did you see anyone by any chance? I saw a girl run into the store over there. Thank you for the information. Okay, so what store? What girl? Do I have to find... Oh, my bad, girl. Do I have to go to a store now? A different store? Let's see. I'm gonna just run past some stores, guys, and see if there's anything that I need to find. Okay, there we go. Oh, wait, no, that's a mine. Interesting. All right. I'm gonna call the coroner over here, guys, to uh, come and take care of this lady. Dispatch requesting coroner. Assistance required in Del Perro. All right, guys, so I'm just trying to see if there's anything else that I have to do. Um, anything that else that I need from dispatch. So we got somebody. We got a name that was Ace. So I don't know if there's anything that we can do about that or if there's... What do I do next? Okay. I'm going to walk up and down over here. Um, that guy said that the girl went into the store, but I'm like, what store? I like want to figure this out for you guys too. All right, I don't think I'm gonna. I don't think we can find her. That might be it. No further units required. All right, guys. So, yeah, we're gonna have to put. Um, how do they say? They'd be like, we're gonna put an APB <laughs> out on an ace, that ace guy. So yeah, that's crazy. But we're gonna have to alert that girl's family. And whatnot so we're gonna have to just do that paperwork on that that's pretty dope guys I'm I'm feeling yeah, that call out you guys let me know uh, what you felt about it if you thought it was cool 
or whatnot, I definitely thought it was interesting and also different. So I want to see if I could also check the weapon uh, myself. Would I have it? Okay, no. Oh, my bad. Dispatch, show me code four on that last call. All right, so we're definitely gonna have to do our own paperwork Attention back at the station units. for that. Uh, for, no but that was required. pretty dope. You guys let me know uh, how you're feeling about it. I'm gonna back up so my partner could get in the car. But yeah, that was, I don't, I've never done that call out before. We so you guys let me know. A civilian in need of assistance. Dispatch, show me responding. What is going on with this corner unit right I'll now? Um, okay, so it seems like somebody called about their friend inhaling helium. All right, let's 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 see what's going on over here. They might be in some type of uh, danger. So we're gonna respond to code two right now. But yeah, if you guys ever did that call out, ooh, it's packed over here. Um, if you guys ever did that call out, definitely comment down below let me know what happened when you guys did it was it the same thing um were you guys able to actually find the person or or what like maybe i needed to do it a different way Ooh. yo i'm just crashing into everything despicable this is so despicable um <laughs> but yeah let me know uh how it went for you guys it's really cool so um yeah i'm excited i'm excited to know and if any other, yeah, of you creators, if you guys are creators out there and I need to do something different, let me know. Because I was really trying to find the girl who went into the place and I was trying to find, you know, that ace guy that the uh, weapon belonged to. That was kind of stupid of him to put it in a, in a trash can, though. Like, what? What? Like, really? Okay, so seems like it's over here. So I'm actually going to go like so all right and then we're just gonna walk can, we, can i drive down the boardwalk can our cops allowed to do this ciao let me go ahead and back it on up that way i don't get y'all in my comments like you can't do that <laughs> all right so i'm gonna take my flashlight out let me know if you guys like me using a flashlight i just i just want to uh just use it i guess but also guys i have been you know trying to grow some plants and stuff like that so recently i'm trying to grow like an avocado plant it's my first time trying so i really hope that it goes good investigate the residence once you find the citizen oh is it this uh, spot sir can i come through here all right let me see about this guy i think it's this guy right here is it is it him sir is it him guys <laughs> I think we at the wrong spot. All right, let me get out of this guy's place before he uh, he called the cops on me for trespassing. All right, where's the person though? Huh. All right, I could have swore that it was that guy. Right, guys? Okay. He was the only person I saw. So I'm thinking that it's him. Guys, what the freak? We got people up here. Where did my partner just... Yo, what is going on with my partner? She is just running up into people. Oh, yo, what is going on with me? My partners have been just doing the damn thing right now. All right, so this is the lady right up here. Good job, Macy. Good job. Hello, ma'am. Can I talk to you really quick? What the hell are you doing on my property? I didn't do anything, I swear. All right, ma'am, uh, I'm trying to get her to like look at her. Let me also change my view for you guys, see if that's a little better. Um, your friend called us to inform us about fainting on FaceTime. She was concerned if something was wrong and you weren't responding to her calls, ma'am. She said, God damn it, okay. All right, pardon? Um, it was Candace, wasn't it? You inhaled too much helium one time at a party and they never let you forget it. It was a prank okay um that's a pretty elaborate prank ma'am anything else you have to say well a few months ago i actually did faint at a party um inhaling helium too much and fell backwards into the punch bowl and brought the whole table down with me my friends have been making fun of me ever since that's pretty funny but that's no excuse to make false police reports i totally agree they crossed the line big time 
and I'm so sorry for the inconvenience, officer. What do you think about this, Macy? This is some foolishness, girl. Uh, clearly, you're the victim here. I'll report the phony call, back, call to dispatch and take care of it. You might want to find some better friends. Good day and stay safe, ma'am. Um, conversation over. Press Y to continue. Handle the situation as you see fit. Uh, press delete when you are finished. Use grammar police. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and code for that situation. Dispatch, show me code four. All right, ma'am, have a good night. Code four, no additional support needed. Ooh, I cannot even get off these stairs. So it just looks like, um, you know, her friends were calling up, uh, making a prank on her. But I was all up in this man's yard. I mean, shambles, guys. But um, that was pretty cool. Um, the, like, all the call-outs today, that was pretty dope. So let me know if you guys like Macy. She definitely found the lady before I did. I did not see that lady at all. I think we can also... Has evaded officers. Needs assistance. Dispatch, I'm responding. In, uh, Pacific Bluff. All right, guys. So we have a fleeing suspect, uh, for a battery. Let's go ahead and... Which way am I going? Let's go ahead and try to, uh, get to them. So we're gonna go code three on this one. All right, ooh, they're pretty. Oh my gosh, did I just go the wrong freaking way? All right, let me turn around right here. Let me put on some sirens, there we go. There we go, guys. I don't know why, anytime I talk to, you know what, anytime I talk to dispatch, there's a button that I have to press on my controller. So, um, and that's the same button for my siren. So sometimes when the siren goes off, um, that's why. Cause like if I talk to, you know, dispatch or anything that is the reason but we're gonna go ahead and catch this person i was just about to end this patrol too i was saying like i could handle another call out and then one came right away so let's go ahead and see if we can kind of catch this suspect who is uh fleeing from another officer and they are wanted for battery people are just running all over the place all right let's go let's go let's go let's go let's see what we got and I don't know, Macy. Today we're gonna we're gonna call this uh, Macy's um, episode because she really out here. She really out here, guys. All right. Where is this? Is it, okay? It's over here. All right. Let's go. Let's go. Excuse me. All right. I'm. I'm. How are they fleeing when they're like all the way up here? Interesting. Look at the deer, guys. Anyway, let me pay attention. Going code three to the situation. Let's see what we got. What happened, too? What's the story? So, I guess they beat somebody up? Hmm, I don't know. Alright, let's see. Let us see. Alright, we're on the way. We're on the way. I wonder if they blocked it off or anything like that. Excuse me, figure it out, bro. Okay, oh, is it this lady? I'm gonna change my view. Why is he running? Get down. Of course, I told y'all Macy was gonna get him. Get down on the ground. Get down, get down on the ground. All right, guys. I was too busy trying to change my view and Macy just definitely stole the show today, guys. I'm just gonna say that, okay? Officer Isla is just here to look good. <laughs> Basically. Alright, this match we have the suspect. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and grab him and move him over um, to the side right here. Alright, we're gonna move him right here. That way Macy can kind of watch him and I can get the car um, out of the way. So, yeah, where'd she go? All right, guys, I'm gonna turn off my siren. I definitely don't want that to be a bother. You guys know, I only like the siren when I'm like chasing and stuff. Like, I definitely don't like it when it comes to like, if we're doing stuff. Okay. All right, let's handle this this way. Let me know if you guys like um, first person too. I don't play in first person a lot, so y'all already know. Dispatch, show me on scene. I'm also gonna get a unit to uh, come out here. I'm gonna see if it can send me a male officer so we can kind of pat this guy down. Oh, he's smooth, ain't he though? Look at him, little freckles and blue eyes and stuff. All right, man, what you doing out here today? 
Um, is it really relevant? It is. Do you have any drugs on you that I should know about? I'm a good citizen. Okay, where'd you come from? Rockford Hills. Okay. All right, let's see what else we can ask him. Um, let's see. So we got calls that you uh, were... Would it be fighting? Yeah, let's say... Uh, so what were you fighting about? We received a complaint. We weren't fighting. Okay, well, we got a call that you're fleeing, uh, you know, and you... Hey, what's going on? That you, uh, you were beating somebody up. So let's go ahead and see if he has something on him, guys. Do you have anything on you that's gonna prick me? No! No, I didn't want her to pat him down. All right, let's go ahead and switch guarding, buddy. There we are. And then now we are going to have the guy pat him down. Do you have anything on you that's gonna prick me, stab me, poke me, or cause me any harm today? With the loafers on though? Okay, I see you. All right, so he has a wallet, a silver necklace, and a baggie full of multicolored pills. Interesting. Dispatch, can I get a pet check on a... What's his name? He had a weird name, guys. What is his name? Dispatch, requesting pet check on a Mike Ibramovskisk. <laughs> Alright, driver's license valid. No active warrants. I'm going to go ahead and uh, see if we can find what those multicolor pills are. Um, yeah. Oh, I, I'm also moving the car, guys, because these people really are acting like they can't drive. All right, let's see. Girl, that's your business. All right, let's see the narcotic test right quick. Let's pull that up, see what the color pills are. I'm thinking it's Molly's or something. Let's see. All right, we're going to pretend that there's a test right there. So it's negative for that. Let me know if you guys like the draw and stuff right here. Um, let's see if it's LSD. Her tattoos is looking good to to too. All right, so it's a baggie full of LSD. So we can I, we can kind of say um, that he was trying to distribute guys, but you let me know. All right, we're gonna go ahead and Mirandize him, okay? So, sir, you have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in the court of law. You have the right to an attorney. If one, if you can't afford one, one will be appointed to you. Having these rights in mind, do you wish to talk to me right now? No. Do you understand your rights have I, as I have explained them? I do. Okay, so let's go ahead and ask him um, who the drugs belong to. Uh, snitches get stitches and I don't talk. <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> I think that's one of the funniest responses I've ever uh, got. Wow. Okay. My laugh was so ugly, but that was so funny. Okay. Um, where did you get him from? I don't have to answer that, cop. Okay. All right. So let's see if there's anything else we can ask him. Hmm. Okay. So is it trafficking or intent to sell? What do you plan to do with him? Nope. I just have a lot for personal use okay interesting 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 guys so um i don't know what else we can ask him but that was that was pretty good that was pretty good um hmm so were you aware that this is a high nah let me see if he'll tell us if he's dealing i don't do uh f you for accusing me okay all right i wanted to see if we could just find any more um information about him guys but what are you doing in this area? I'm meeting my friend Michael DeSanta here. All right, so I think we got enough information that we need from him. This officer looking smooth, okay. Wave check, I don't know what y'all think. Anyway, let me go over here because y'all know when I'm too close, I kind of um, can't do the charges or whatnot. But let's go ahead and bring my tablet up. Here we go. And he doesn't have a gun permit, no outstanding warrants. Um, he is 20 years of age. He just got a, a citation. That's it. Um, we're going to go ahead and ha arrest him because he definitely um, is wanted for, it said battery or something, right? So we're going to say simple battery. And also, I don't know if it was battery on the law enforcement officer or just regular battery. So we might have to clear that up some way, somehow. Um, we also have him on the fact that he was trying to flee from law enforcement um, and then he also had the uh, baggie of 
it was LSD, right? You guys correct me in the comments if I'm wrong. We're definitely gonna say um, intent to distribute, okay? So um, yeah, that's gonna be his charges today. Let me know if you guys enjoy this episode with Officer Isla and Officer Macy, who definitely stole the show. Like, girl is like from from feet to, to the top of her head, from head to toe. This girl was on it today. Check the watch, okay? Check the blink. All right, she was on it. So we're gonna have um, Officer Mike right here go ahead and take this guy. And um, required in, yeah, that's uh, basically going to be it for four. us today. We're gonna let dispatch know that we are, you know, we're we're going. Uh, what is it? Ten six. So let me go ahead and just put. Uh, well, we're actually ending our um, tour too. So we're gonna say ten ending four. tour. All right. Oh, dispatch, show me ten six. Acknowledged. One queen five. Did you really, lady? Almost run me over. All right, guys, so they got them in the car. I'm gonna go ahead and get in my car. Let me know if you guys liked um, the whole, what is it called? Like being first person and stuff like that. I'm just gonna go ahead and get in our vehicle, see the other officer leaving and whatnot. And um, yeah, let's go ahead and see the charges that everyone got. This is definitely weird driving in first person. I am not, I don't like this. Mm-mm, mm-mm, child. Okay, I'm gonna pull out of the way like that because I, I believe I'm in their way. Okay, but I don't know if you guys have seen the inside of the vehicle, but here it is. Thank you so much, Macy, for having my back today, girl. You was on it, girl, okay? That's that, that's that, you know, melanin magic right there. Um, Cause you know, Macy's Spanish, okay? And she has melanin too. But anyway, let's go ahead into the computer and see what we got, guys, okay? So we have Christian Jones, um, the guy that was just trespassing. We gave him a citation. So it seems like they come off about like $7 off of that citation because he was originally fined $800. And then we have this guy, Mike, who uh, was fleeing for simple battery, eluding arrest from law enforcement on foot, possession of LSD and intent to distribute. He was given one year in prison and fined a total of $1,340. Um, and he was given one year only for the LSD. So let me know if you guys think that was fair or not. He was granted probation on the simple battery charge and eluding arrest from law enforcement on foot. So yeah, I don't know. Let me know what you guys uh, thought about that. I thought he was going to get a little bit more time. And um, yeah, I don't, I don't know. But as always, make sure you guys go ahead and like up this episode. Make sure to share, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. And I will catch you guys in the next episode. Bye.